Hernán Pérez de Quesada Hernán Pérez de Quesada, sometimes spelled as de Quesada, till the 1500 to 1544, was a Spanish conquistador. Second in command of the army of his elder brother, Gonzalo Jiménez de Quesada, Hernán was part of the first European expedition towards the inner highlands of the Colombian Andes. The harsh journey, taking almost a year and many deaths, led through the departments Magdalena, Cesar, Santander, Boyaga, Cundinamarca and Huila of present-day Colombia between 1536 and 1539 and, without him, Meta, Caqueta and Putumayo of Colombia and northern Peru and Ecuador between 1540 and 1542. Hernán founded Ciutat Ausa, Cundinamarca, and aided in the conquest of various indigenous groups, such as the Chimula, Muisca, Panch, Lash, Uwa, Sitagao and others. Under the command of Hernán Pérez de Quesada the last Muisca ruler, Zacaquim and Zac were publicly decapitated. As second in command under his brother, in the previous year Zipas Tisquisusa and Sajipa and Tundama of Duitama had suffered a similar fate. Dot after returning from his expeditions to the south reaching Quito, where he reunited with his younger brother Francisco, both de Quesadas went back to Bogota. Hernán was tried and imprisoned there for the murders of the Muisca rulers by the governor of the capital of the new kingdom of Granada. In 1544, en route back to Spain with his brother Francisco, their ship was hit by lightning off the coast of Cabo de la Vela in the Caribbean Sea killing Hernán and Francisco and wounding several other conquistadors who were returning to Spain. Knowledge of the life and expeditions of Hernán Pérez de Quesada has been provided by his brother Gonzalo and scholars Pedro de Aguado, Juan Frail, Lucas Fernández de Piedrejita, Joaquín Acosta, and Liborio Zerda. Biography Early Life Hernán Pérez de Quesada was born around the year 1500 in the Andalusian city of Granada as second son of Luis Jiménez de Quesada and Isabel de Rivera Quesada. His family was Catholic, but descended from Moranos, Sephardi Jews. His elder brother was conquistador Gonzalo Jiménez and he had four other siblings, brother Melchor, Francisco, who also was conquistador in Peru, and sisters Magdalena de Quesada and Andrea Jiménez de Quesada. Hernán also had a half-sister, Isabel de Quesada. In 1535, arriving early 1536, the brothers Gonzalo, Francisco and Hernán sailed from Spain to Santa Marta, the first city founded in Colombia, by Rodrigo de Bastidas in 1525. Conquest in Colombia 1536, the harsh route towards Muisca territory. The first indigenous group that was submitted to the Spanish crown were the Tirona, who inhabit the area around Santa Marta, presently living on the slopes of the Sierra Nevada de Santa Marta and in Tirona Park. On April 6, 1536, triggered by the stories of the mythical city of Gold El Dorado, Gonzalo Jiménez de Quesada organized two groups of conquistadors towards the inner highlands of the Colombian Andes, as first European explorers. The army with the brothers de Quesada and more than 700 soldiers and 80 horses went over land and another, of more than 200 men, embarked in boats and ascended the Magdalena River from Cienega, in search of its origin. The list of the soldiers that eventually made it to Funza has been compiled by Juan Flores de Caris, 1612-1692. The land army was led by Gonzalo with Hernán second in command. The first indigenous group conquered, were the Chimala people. Continuing south, the troops had to cross inhospitable terrains full of creeks and part of their supplies and equipment was lost when crossing the Araguani River. The troops led by the de Quesadas passed through among other settlements to Malamec, Barranca Bermeja and Chipata where the Spanish for the first time learned to drink chicha, the fermented alcoholic beverage of the Muisca. The almost naked conquistadors who suffered from the difficult expedition through the jungles received cotton mantles from the Muisca people in Chipata. The expedition passed through halted in Chia where they spent the Holy Week. After that week in April 1537, he ordered his men towards Funza, the site of the domain of the Zipa. Although the army of the brothers de Quesada was reduced to 170 men, the hundreds of Quechua warriors couldn't resist their superior arms and were defeated. In the meantime, Zipatisquisusa sent messengers to the caciques in the Muisca Confederation to inform them of the arrival of the light-skinned heavily armed men. The caciques considered the invaders sacred and didn't dare to attack them. Funza was conquered and founded on April 20, 1537. Of the more than 900 soldiers who left Santa Marta a year earlier, only 162 survived the harsh expedition. 
On the same day that his brother Gonzalo founded Tensa, June 24, 1537, Hernán founded Ciutata Usa. First Conquest by Hernán Pérez de Quesada 1538, Establishment of Bogotá and Surroundings At the start of 1538, when the troops were exhausted after almost two years in foreign terrain, the soldiers asked what was their payment for the conquest they had done. De Quesada divided the conquered treasures over his men. 40,000 pieces of fine gold, 562 emeralds and tumbega, gold copper silver alloys. Foot soldiers received 520 pieces each, horse riders the double amount, captains 2080 pieces, generals 3640 and some pieces were given as prizes for the most distinguished soldiers. Top masses were organized to honor the many dead soldiers during the campaign and part of the treasure was given to Juan de las Casas. De Quesada was not pleased to hear about the advancement of another group of conquistadors in the east, led by Nicolas Federman, coming from later Venezuela across the Llanos Orientales. Another team of conquerors, commanded by Sebastián de Belalcázar, was coming from the south, originating from Quito. Gonzalo sent Hernán to meet the southern group who had traveled through the hot valley of Neva. Hernán ordered the decapitation of Aquimanzac, the last Zac of Hunza in late 1538. Foundation of Bogota One and a half year after the victory of the conquistadors on Tisquisusa, in the area of Tuzaquilo, the modern capital of Colombia was founded. Although some historians set the date at April 27, 1539, the common and celebrated date of foundation is August 6, 1538. The foundation was performed by the construction of twelve houses of reed, referring to the twelve apostles, and the construction of a preliminary church, also of reed. Dat Father Juan de las Casas held his first mass in the improvised church. The city was named Santa Fe de Bogota, a combination of the Spanish city of Santa Fe and the cheap name of the southern Muisca capital Bacata, meaning enclosure outside of the farm fields. The newly established country, part of the Spanish Empire was called New Kingdom of Granada, after the place of birth of the brothers de Quesada in Andalusia, Kingdom of Granada. Return to Spain of Gonzalo, Sebastián and Nicolás The three leaders of the conquest expeditions, Gonzalo de Quesada, Nicolás Federman and Sebastián de Belalcázar, met in Bosa and agreed to travel back to Spain to ask for compensation for their exploration for the Spanish crown. Gonzalo assigned Hernán as interim governor of the new kingdom and chose the first mayor and council for the capital. The chaplain of the team of Federman, Juan Verdejo, was named priest. Most of the soldiers of the expeditions of Federman and de Belalcázar decided to stay in Bogotá, reinforcing the troops of de Quesada. Without having found El Dorado, three years after his departure from Santa Marta, in mid May 1539, Gonzalo Jiménez de Quesada returned to the Caribbean coast to sail to Spain from Cartagena. Hernán in charge of the New Kingdom of Granada. 1540-1541 In his search for El Dorado, Hernán explored the departments of Tolima and Huila. Hernán Pérez de Quesada was only one of many explorers in the search for El Dorado. After the destruction and looting of the Sun Temple in Sacamasso in September 1537, Hernán Pérez thought there was an even bigger place where the indigenous people hid their gold, called La Casa del Sol. In his quest, starting from Sacamasso along the right banks of the Chicamoca River, he approached with a hundred men the terrain of the Lash and entered Jericho, at that time called Cheva, where he and his troops gathered the food of the original inhabitants who promptly fled to Chita. The city of Tunja, in the times of the Muisca called Hunza, was founded on 1541 by Gonzalo Suarez Rendon in an expedition ordered by Hernán de Quesada. In July 1541, the chapter of Tunja told de Quesada that he couldn't leave his empire alone. Hernán responded that whatever he did, was in the interest of the Spanish crown. Later in 1541, Hernán Pérez de Quesada went northward towards the later department of Norte de Santander, where he crossed Pancalba, Guacamayas, El Cacui, and Chita, and reached China Cota but had to return soon after that. Soldiers of his army submitted the U living in El Cacui. On his southern expedition in the same year, Hernán Pérez de Quesada was the first European to reach the southeastern Colombian departments of Caqueta and Putumayo. One of his soldiers, Lázaro Fuente, the lover of Zoritama, died due to the natural dangers of the jungle. Second Conquest by Hernán Pérez de Quesada Reunion with his brother Francisco and death 
De Quesada reached Peru with an army of 500 men, without finding the mythical El Dorado. In 1542 he reached the kingdom of Quito in a bad shape where he joined his brother Francisco. Both brothers returned to Bogota, where Hernán was tried and imprisoned by Luis Alonso de Lugo, the new governor of the capital after Hernán, for his mistreatment of the indigenous peoples and the murders of Tundama, Aquimansac, Tisquisusa, and Sajipa. In 1544 Hernán and Francisco embarked on a ship back to Spain, that was hit by lightning off the coast of Cabo de la Vela. Both brothers died and several other conquistadors who were returning to their home country were wounded. Conquistadors who were returning to their home country were wounded.